guys, it's Story and welcome, welcome. So today's video is going to be another Dollar Tree DIY home decor project and I'm going to be making a faux mirror tea light candle holder that hangs on the wall. So here's your sneak peek of what you're gonna see. And let's just go ahead and get started. I'm going to use this poster board that I picked up from my Dollar Tree as my base and then I also got these little silver plates out of the party section of my Dollar Tree and the piece that I'm going to be making is going to be three plates wide by seven plates tall. And then I'm going to have 11 little shelves so I'm going to need a total of 32 so I picked up four packs of these plates. To hold the little tea lights on the shelves I'm using these silver napkin rings that match perfectly to the little silver plates and they were also in the party section of my Dollar Tree. Like I said I'm making 11 little shelves and these come in packs packs of six, so I picked up two packs of the napkin rings. I'm taking the plates one by one and I'm applying four dabs of hot glue onto the four corners of the little bases of the bottom of the plate and then just pressing them onto the poster board. And I just repeated this with the other plates, making sure to get them as best aligned as I could as I went along. With all my plates attached, as you can see, I didn't use all of the poster board, so I just flipped the project over and then I took a box cutter and I just trimmed away the excess pieces of the poster board. With my poster board cut down to size, I'm now going to be putting my hook on the back because it'll be easier to get to the back of the project now instead of when the shelves are on. The hooks I'm using are these plastic velcro command strips and to use these I just press two of them together and then I peel away one sticky part and then pressed it onto the back of my poster board. Now to assemble the shelves I'm just taking one napkin ring and one plate at a time and I'm applying some hot glue to the brim of the napkin ring and then placing it on the plate in the center. Then I'm coming in with a brush and some E6000 and reinforcing the seam between the plate and the napkin ring. This epoxy will hold a lot better but it takes a long time to dry so that's why I put the hot glue down first to hold everything in place until the epoxy can dry. I just repeated this until all 11 of my shelves were done and then I let these sit like this overnight so that the epoxy could dry completely. Now to connect my shelves to my mirror I'm just putting some hot glue on the edge of my shelf plate and then pressing it on the seam of the bottom of the first row and the top of the second row. I put two shelves on the outside of one row and then one in the middle of the following row and just repeated this all the way down. My project's ready to hang so I just peeled the other backing off my command strip and then pressed it against the wall. I bought this pack of tea lights from the Dollar Tree as well to place inside the napkin rings and they don't fit all the way down in but they do nestle in just enough to hold them in place. And here's one final shot for you guys of how the project turned out. Well that's it, but before I let you guys go, I have to give you a disclaimer really fast. I had actually lit the candles on this project to get my like thumbnail shots and everything, and while I was doing that, the heat from the candles was rising and it was melting the hot glue that was holding the little like shelves onto the mirror part, so the shelves start slowly falling down and dropping the candles and getting the wax everywhere, and it was a big old mess. And then while I'm cleaning everything up, like look, I found these shelves have holes burnt right through them, because of course like the heat was rising up underneath them from the candles below and I should have known better because when you heat up hot glue like of course it becomes malleable so I just wanted to let you guys know if you're gonna be making this maybe don't actually light the candles just leave them out for decorative purposes because it turned into a big old mess so that's everything and I will link here the playlist to all of my other Dollar Tree DIY home decor projects so you can check all those out if you'd like to and as always thanks for watching I'll see you soon bye bye